Right, so I'm going to play through the jig that I taught at Sidmouth, uh, the one in F major that was called Johnny McGill. Um, and I'm just going to start first uh, by playing the notes of the F major scale. Um, so you're starting on an F, uh, a low F, and going up to a high F. Uh, and you want to make sure that, that you play B flat. There's only one flat in the F major scale, and that is B flat. So you, we're going to play it step by step, each note, F, low F to high F, going up the way, and then we're going to come back down the way after that. Um, and I'll just play through this scale so that you can hear all the notes of the F major scale before we start this tune. how it should sound uh, at normal speed. Um, so, yeah, I'll, I'll play through it a couple of times slowly and then bring it up to speed. Um, what I would recommend doing is actually just listening to the recording of me playing a few times before you try learning it yourself, because that way you'll have the tune in your head and it'll be a lot easier to try and learn it by ear if you have the tune in your head. Um, after you've listened to the tune a few times, you could also try singing it through slowly um, and uh, using your, your hands to place where the pitch is in the tune. Um, that might be helpful for you as well. Um, and just do that a few times until you've got it in your head. Uh, before you, you try and do it on your instrument. Uh, and when you're actually learning it on the instrument, um, just take your time with it, okay? Go really slowly and really listen out to, to those notes. Right? Really listen out and make sure that you're getting every note right. Um, but take your time and, and uh, yeah, and it should be okay.
now gonna bring it up to speed. as well. Once you get a bit more comfortable playing the tune, um, you can you can start maybe adding your own variations or you know mixing the, the variations around to suit yourself. Um, so that's all for me. Thanks very much.